guys, welcome back. In today's video, we are reviewing the Color Club Paris Parisian Gardens collection. Um, this collection dropped recently. It's not their latest, which will be coming to my channel soon, but it, 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 it was the one that released right before that. I have them right here. It's made up of six polishes. They're all cream colors, very springy, and it's very green heavy, which I'm not mad about, honestly. Anyways, this collection was sent to me by um, Color Club as PR. I have been added to their PR list, so I'm super excited about that. And I also have a new code that you guys can use. I will be putting all the information somewhere here on the screen or down in the description. Um, now, a little bit of background about Color Club and why I had never reviewed them before. Um, I never felt like they really released collections like the spring collection, the winter collection. And I'm used to hearing my channel reviewing collections as they drop, like the current ones, you know? And the Color Club collections in the past have been, let's say that they have their hollows and then they add to that one. Or they have their neons and then they add to that one. So it's not like, like now, I feel, where they're doing more of a release, you know, constantly, new stuff. And so that's it. And on top of that, I've been added to the period list, which means I will be getting the new collection so I can share them with you guys. Now, a little bit more background about me and Color Club. I have been buying Color Clubs for, I'll say like almost a decade because my local supply store has Color Clubs for under $3. Now they're not new, so I usually just buy colors that I like just for myself. Nothing I can really review with you guys for like current content. So that's why I never really shared share them here. I share them on my Instagram. And then on top of that, story time. In early 2019, I won a giveaway that Color Club had for a $250 gift card. That was bomb. And so I waited for a sale, which allowed me to like increase the amount of money that I could spend. It was great. I think I bought 48 polishes with that gift card. And another friend of mine, Mel, she also won that giveaway that same year, like two months after, and someone else did. Like, they did a lot of giveaways that year, so I got lucky. And on top of that, they started selling Color Clubs of Ross. So I will put a clip here of my Color Club collection real quick so you guys can see it if you haven't seen it. All right, so let's go into this drawer. I have here all the neon pastels that they have. Well, most of them, not all. I have a bunch of the pop plastic neons, well, mostly a bunch of those. I have all of these are their hollows. Color Club has some of the best hollows out there. I'm sorry, that is just the truth. And I also have a couple of gels that I've bought in my supply store, but it's just like a handful of them. A um, bunch of glitters. Oh, I also got some thermals that I've never really worn. But yes, I have a lot of them. So that's more or less a little bit of rambling as to why you had never seen them here on my YouTube. I usually just keep them on Instagram and don't cover full collections for the most part. But I will from now on. So let's get into the swatches because I cannot wait to show you guys these polishes. The formulas are so good and they updated their brush from like the older stuff that I used to buy to really nice wide paddle brushes, which I love. And the collections are so, not the collections, the formula is so like well behaved. I don't know how to, how to put this, but like it stays where you put it and it barely runs. So they're pretty opaque. They feel um, smooth, but they stay put, which I thought was so nice. So let's get into the swatch and I'm sorry for rumbling, but I had a little bit of story time and I wanted to give you guys some background. So let's get into them. First up, we have Olive Paris, and this is an olive green on the lighter side. A little bit muted, a little bit dusty. The formula is amazing. I love this color, and I feel like this color is in. This type of like light olive, I've seen this around a lot. And even like in gel, like the long gel nails that are matte, I've seen this. Also, reminder, all the Color Club colors are available in gel as well on their website. So I forgot about that. But yeah, if you, if you like any of these colors that I'm describing here, you can get them in gel from their website. And I actually recommend that you keep an eye out because they have a lot of nice sales, you guys. <laughs> Next up we have, okay, this is a Spanish word. I'm not even gonna pretend to read it in English. Jardin, that's, that's garden in Spanish. <laughs> This is just a green um, 
I don't know if we have like any type of like. It's not a forest green. It's not a jade green. It's just a green. It's very beautiful. Another gorgeous formula, and this is very springy. It's great for floral nail art. And I always say this when I see a good green, but you need green for the florals, like for the details. So this one I think will be amazing for that. Really, really beautiful. Next up we have Lily in Paris, and this is a lilac purple. You can see it here. Beautiful formula, beautiful polish, no complaints whatsoever. This is another one that's good for comparisons because I own a lot of purples. Um, but it's probably too long to put in this video, so I'll probably just do it on my Instagram. But, oh my God, this is beautiful, you guys. And I just love the white brushes so much. It's just, 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 just so good. I have nothing else to say. It's gorgeous, it's beautiful, beautiful, perfecto, beautiful. Next up we have Bouquet of the Day. Bouquet, Bouquet. These names are testing me. These names are testing me. Pink, beautiful, springy, good formula. I sound like a broken record. There's nothing else to say. It's just a gorgeous pink. Gorgeous formula, gorgeous brush. Beautiful. That's it. The final test of pronunciation. La Vie en Rose. I know I butchered that. That does, this is nothing like what... When I hear people on TV reading this phrase, I sound nothing like that. So, excuse me. If there's anybody here that's French that's seeing this video, please just, I'm sorry, in advance, okay? All right, so... This is a gorgeous light coral, heavily pink. So we'll say corally pink or pinky coral. Beautiful, opaque in two coats, perfectly springy. Um, it's like a pastel light coral. It's gorgeous. I know I sound like a broken record in this video, but it is what it is. Next up we have Mercy Boo Blue. And I butchered that. I know we all know I butchered it, yes. You'll see the name here in the description. I'm not gonna pretend I can pronounce this. And this is just pretty much gorgeous. And when I saw this, the first thing I thought about was Bloomint. Is it Blooming? Blooming? There's another color club that's super famous. I will add a comparison of them two right after this little section for these swatches. But this color is beautiful. And with no white under, you get such a pop of color that it's just Freaking perfection. It is perfect for spring, but also summer, for pedicures. This is just gorgeous. There's nothing else. This is a kiss. I love it. I love it. Okay, now that we have seen all of them, my favorite is this one. I think you can tell by my enthusiasm when I was talking about it. I'm sorry, this is just perfection. And it, it just goes perfectly into summer as well. But you know, I, I wear anything at any time, but I'm just saying like this one's a good summer polish as, as well as a spring polish and pedicure and all the everythings, right? So overall, I think the collection is gorgeous. I love the fact that it is green heavy. What can I say? That's just the truth. Um, the polishes have amazing quality. The formulas are so good. When you, when you put them in place, they stay. And they self-level beautifully. And they're shiny. And they're gorgeous. So I think Color Club did a fantastic job with this collection. I absolutely love it. And that's it. I cannot wait to see what else Color Club releases. Because now that I'm going to be covering them on my YouTube, I'm very excited. Thank you, Color Club, for sending these to me. And I hope you guys like this review. And tune in for the next one. Bye!